por eso. Ah. Ah. Papá. When did you arrive? What an inconsequential question. What has that got to do with the fact that I'm here? I'm here, I'm here! Hey, nobody get this thing inside. Um, <coughs> Papa. Papa, you're welcome. Mm -hmm. Thank you. But I mean, we were so surprised to see you. She didn't inform us you were coming, so we weren't expecting you at all. Oh. I have to call and notify you that I'm coming to my son's house. Huh? You people think you're living in America. Anyway, I just wanted to surprise myself. Oh, indeed. It's a pleasant surprise. Oh. But you're not used to traveling with bags. This one that you're all packed this time. Do you intend to be here with us for for long? You are questioning how long can we stay in my son's house? Wait for your information. I will be here sometime. Oh. <coughs> You're welcome. Thank you. Um, babe, uh, huh? at least taking his luggage into the guest room. Why me? Why me? No, why? Why should I be the one to do that? Can't you do that? I am going to fetch him something to eat. Besides, Baba brought this bag all the way from the village alone, unaided. Alright, so please don't make him look like, like, like a bad person. Excuse me. Papa, don't worry. Um, I'll handle it. Okay? <laughs> I wish you. <laughs> My son! Papa the Papa. <laughs> Let's go to the room now. <laughs> <laughs> Papa, the Papa. <laughs> Papa, I'm so happy that you decided to come here. You know, at a point I was scared of, of something happening to you in the town. You don't even know what is happening. You have not had half of what is happening. You know your cousin Uchen. Uh -huh. His wife got pregnant for her pastor and died trying to abort it. Jesus. Oh, Papa. <laughs> You know, I've always suspected that that woman is well warned. That is even not. You know, we warned the children not to marry that girl. Her people rarely stay in marriage. All right, that is not even enough. The other day, Am Robbers came to the house of uh, some of the tenants staying by that junction. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they entered one man's house. They tied him up and then they raped his wife in his presence. Jesus. They took her turn by turn until she lost consciousness. Jesus, that is terrible. That is nothing yet. The one I'm about to tell you now will shock you. Hey, now wow. <laughs> hey, what a what a village. What a what a sad village. Everything that happens in that place is sad. Tragic stories, bitter uh, tales. Babe, 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 there seems not to be anything good coming out from that village at all. See, <laughs> hey, now wow. Babe, babe, babe. Oh, hmm. whenever I'm talking with my father, shocker. Please don't interrupt. Please, next time, filter some good stories from that village and bring for us. Ha! I warned you not to marry that girl. Just as we warned you, Jenna, your cousin. Her mother is evil, and the snake must give birth to something long like a snake. Papa, how, how long, how many times have we gone through this? Eh? Please, leave her and then. <laughs> give me more gist. <laughs> Let me tell you more. <laughs> What is going on here? I'm sure you're not blind. Or you just want to be noticed. Yeah, calm down. Just calm down. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Look, carry your drama and go somewhere else. I don't have time for you. I'm busy. Papa! Papa, you cannot cook your concussion in my kitchen. You can't. You're not ashamed of yourself. Look at how unhealthy my son looks because of the rubbish you cook and give him in the name of food. Hmm? Well, I am here now. And I'm going to be preparing our traditional delicacy for my son and I. Why you go and cook whatever you like? 
I just finished the delicacy soup and I'm trying to palm something for Papa, you. Papa, Papa, my Papa, please. Papa, don't piss me off. Papa, please do not piss me off at all. I mean, what is all this now? Do I need to? Am, 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 am I marrying the same man with you? Why are you in contest with me? Over my own kitchen, Papa. Papa, this is my kitchen. This is my office. You can't be here. If you want to cook your concussion, you go back to your village and cook it all. You are not allowed to cook this here, Papa, please. Return this your matter to anywhere you got it from. This matter is not going anywhere. Papa, Papa, you lie. Papa, Papa, let me tell you, eh? This is just a very big lie because I will not let you come into my home and divide my family. What is all this? How many pots of food is going to come out from my kitchen? In this small family? What is all this, Papa? Have you been the one cooking for my husband? That's your business. Papa, please. What? Papa, please, 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 please. Papa, don't piss me off, please. Uh -huh. It's not even in a man's place to be in the kitchen. Look at you, just went and tied your up like a woman and, and you're, you're, you're here fighting with me. What is all this, Papa? Look. All right. Are you a woman? Wait. You want me to tie this your up and you start acting like a woman? What is all this? Uh -uh. Look at this man. Oh. What is what? What kind of temptation is this one now? What is this one? No peace of mind in my own husband. What is this? Where do I start from? Hi, I'm going to lama here. To offer truth, offer truth. He that must swallow another that she must consider the size of his enos. What is it? Dave, my son. Your wife give me the insult of my life today. What's my offense? I just said, let me surprise my son. With that, our native delicacy I was preparing in the kitchen. Is it that your wife now came in and saw me and threw me out of my son's kitchen? She practically carried me and threw me out of the kitchen. That is my offense. So. Can you imagine? Hey, hey, Papa, Papa, you are being so dramatic. What kind of drama is this? All this drama is for what? That I sent you out of my kitchen? No, no, why should I share my kitchen with you? As what? As my co wife or what? Eh? As my co-wife, are you my co-wife? Why should I share my kitchen with you, Papa? Why? How dare you go into my kitchen without taking permission from me? Seriously! Liz, Papa, if you so want to cook your concussion, I am not stopping you from preparing. Hey, will you keep quiet? I am not done! Papa, go to your village. Cook your concussion there. Invite your son over there to eat with you. Not in my kitchen. Will you keep quiet? See, babe, that food you call concussion, mm -hmm. that is what I have been fed with all through my life. Mm -hmm. You see this man here? He's the reason I'm alive. Okay. You see this man here? <laughs> He's the reason I am married to you. Father of the year. Have it in your head. Mm, well done. What, a, what, what, what an extraordinary thing has he done? No, tell me. A father being a father to his son? What is extraordinary about it? And seriously, who was supposed to take care of you as a child? Me? See, Papa, respect yourself. Respect yourself, oh. Just respect yourself because if you come into my kitchen again, I am going to change it for you. What kind of nonsense is it? Should I be debating my kitchen with a, with a man? Thank God you said this man here, not this woman here. This man, what business does this man here have in my kitchen? As what? As my fellow wife or what? Ah, what is all this nonsense, Papa? The next time you come there, I will change it for you. You will not like me. I don't like you as it is. Okay. Sorry. I already see your bad character okay. and I don't like you. But let me tell you. You see that kitchen? Mm -hmm. It is my son's kitchen. And I will cook anything I want to cook in that kitchen. Okay. Papa, I'm going ahead of you. Come and meet me there. Eh, eh, my fellow wife, eh? My co come and meet me there, my co-wife. I am waiting for you. Uh -huh. I think it's co-wives now, now. Co-wives, isn't it? I'm waiting for you in the kitchen. Come and meet me. You see it now, Dave. I want you not to marry this girl now that is behaving like her mother. You say she's behaving like her mother. And I told you what her mother looks like. I told you not to marry her, but you will not listen to me. Now look at it now. A woman that squats to urinate is now threatening me. A man that stands to urinate in my son's kitchen. Uh, Dave, I will use that pestle in the kitchen. I uh, know, Papa. Papa, 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 please, 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 please. I don't know what is wrong with my father-in-law. I don't know. He's in the habit of always showing up unannounced. <laughs> and this time, this man just landed. The next minute he was in my kitchen pounding. <laughs> Mama, pounding like a woman with wrapper around his waist. I mean, what is that? Mama, this is not funny now. <laughs> I told you before you got married to Dave, that you have to be ready to tolerate Sam. He's a very petty man. Very, very petty. Mama, this is beyond pettiness. That man has a nasty attitude. Like, we literally live under the same roof as if we are co-wives. <laughs> a man acting like a woman. 
Mama, this is not funny now. You are still young. Don't worry. You are getting more mature. And you'll discover oh. that but every union has its own challenges. Hmm? Mama, this my own came in a very wrong form. I will not even lie. I mean, what is this? I've heard people talk about their mother-in-laws in their marriages, like complain. But I mean, I've never heard anyone complain about a father-in-law. Father-in-law acting like a woman, as if we are two <laughs> wives. Mama, it, Mama, it's not even funny. You, you, you. <laughs> Mama, this is not funny at all. Don't even laugh about it because I don't know how long I can bear this. You don't worry. It will soon come to pass. Eh? Uh, just make sure you try to, to live in peace with him and your husband. <laughs> try not to disrespect them. Ha, Mama, me, I cannot guarantee that. I cannot. Ha, it's not easy. That man. I can't. Oh, I don't know. That's why I said <sighs> try. After he's, he's your father-in-law. Then he has to act accordingly. Not acting like a woman. Now tell me. What will you do if they have disrespect me? Hmm. Mama, that is not even possible. How on earth can they disrespect you? Mama, <laughs> you look nothing like that. In fact, you, you, you're you nothing like that man. There is nothing on earth you will do that will make Dave disrespect because you respect yourself. Where is the disrespect going to come from? Mama, please me, I cannot continue with that man in that house. So I cannot guarantee anything because the way that man is going... We, we, I, see, ha. <laughs> I, I can't stand a man, a, a man acting like a woman and, and tying rappers around and behaving like, <laughs> behaving like, 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 like. Mama, it's not funny. It's not even funny at all. I don't know why you are laughing. It's, it's not funny. I'm because really. So before what is so before I'm, I told you to face this. Look, eh, good a thing you came. Otherwise, I would have killed someone. I'm telling you, that my father-in-law. I am losing it with him completely. Just imagine. What have I done to him? Do you know that people pray for their mother-in-laws to die before they marry their sons? So that they can have a peaceful marriage, but my own, no, he it's my father-in-law. It's very difficult, but you have to follow them diplomatically. See, I am not going to be diplomatic about anything. No. I am losing because I'm just one human being. And there's a limit to every human endurance. As it is now, I have gotten no. to my elastic limit. No. You don't have to beg her not to lose it. Let her lose it. You lose it, I tighten it for you again. Wait, wait, wait. Papa, so it has gotten to the extent that you lock around to eavesdrop into my conversation with my friend in my own house. Oh, no. Do you like I, get, I get very, 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 very angry when you call this place your house. Uh -uh. This is my son's house and I can do whatever I like. Look at <laughs> See how you squander my son's money. You are jobless. You do not contribute money or anything to make the house go forward you now go and carry a whole bottle of wine for you and your friend you see what i'm saying <laughs> my friend give me the wine there's mineral in the fridge go and bring one bottle and share between you <laughs> and your friend ne, please do not be offended things are very difficult and we have to manage she understands Thank you very much. Do you understand? Susan, hold me. Hold me. Hold me because I am going to kill somebody. Can you just imagine? Can you imagine in my own house? You have to calm down. This is a very precarious issue. I have to handle it diplomatically. See, I am going see, Susan, you do not even understand. If I continue to live in this house with this man, I am going to break every single bone he has in his, in, in, in his body. Uh -uh. You don't have to think of getting physical with your father-in-law. Any ear that hears that will tingle. Let the ear tingle. No, no, no. Let the ear start tingling now. Because I am going to kill somebody in this house. I cannot let this man make me uncomfortable in my own husband's house. I will not let it because I'm going to do it with violence. Susan, I know you are angry, but you have to calm down. This is not relationship. It's marriage. You have to treat him like your father for peace to reign in your house. That man cannot best me. Even if you don't like him, you have to pretend. That man does not look like my father and can never be my father susan watch me i am going to get you another bottle of wine Just... <laughs> 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 papa <laughs> 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 
What is this? What the? Papa, what are you doing in my room? What are you doing brushing in on me like that? This is my private space for crying out loud. Babe, oh. babe, calm down. No, 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 I'm not coming down. Coming down for what? Now, what is all this? Margaret Thatcher, get the cane. Come and flog me. Ah! I thank my ancestors for today. Today I have gotten the answer to one problem I've always had. Today I have the answer. I wonder how you managed to remote my son like this. Uh, but today I have the I have the answer. Papa, what do you mean by that? Will you shut up there? How can you allow her to stay on top of you? You let the woman stay on top. She subdued you spiritually, and that is why she. What makes her think she's important all over here? Eh? Papa, please, can you go? Um, is that all you have to say to him? Is that all you have to say to him? What kind of nonsense is this? I have Papa following me everywhere, and everywhere in this house, including my bedroom. Supposing I was naked, what happens? What is all this mess? David, come down. Let us go. Come down from that bed, let's go. Oh, if I teach you, if you get out, if I don't, follow your father and leave. I'm, you, I'm, you, you, I'm, I'm, I'm still up now. Papa, go, go, go out. I'll, I'll, I'll join you. What's what? <laughs> Why are you my, embarrassing me? I don't son, like this. I don't worry, I understand. Uh, let me give you time. Hurry up and be down. And be down. Uh, then you come and join me in the parlor. Don't ever let her stay on top of you again. She stopped doing this spiritually. Hey God, okay, hey, God. What kind of rubbish is oh, this? What, nah, what kind of a mess have I got to myself into? Hey, what kind of a mess is this? It's okay. It's no, no, no. Let him come now. Let's just do three songs together now. Let him come. Let him come now. See my co wife. Get, 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 get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. My son. <laughs> you know, the best moments of my life are the times I'm, I'm here with you, Justin. I know. I can't even remember the last time we had a gist uninterrupted. I miss also. I miss us too. <laughs> and I promise you, from today onwards, mm. you will always have this time with me. Yes. That, it is necessary. Very Let good. us toast. Let us toast to the bond of love that is holding us together since we uh, lost your mom, my wife. We toast to it. Toast. <laughs> This is good at camera. <laughs> it's good at camera. Um, you know, let me tell you something. What? I will live longer for you if you make our time to gist with me like this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Papa. I will always make our time for us to gist. Very necessary. Because I want you to live long for me. Ah, thank you very much, my son. And um, that reminds me, Papa. Uh, you said something about wanting to discuss something with me. Ah, it's true. I forgot it. But when I remember, we will talk it. And we will just eat. Papa, you know I can swear with my life that you had nothing to tell me. Yes. Oh. You just wanted to spike my, my wife. <laughs> Who is she? Where was she when your sister and I trained you, raised you up to this level? For her to now take you, put you inside the bedroom and lock you up and have all your attention. It can't happen now. <laughs> it cannot happen. No problem, Papa. I promise you, I will give you all the attention you need. <laughs> now you are talking. Now you are talking. <laughs> but that aside, do you have any gist for me? Gist? Of course, I will always have gist for you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, that reminds me. Uh, when I went uh, 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 out earlier, I saw the secretariat of the Christian Men Organization. <laughs> I went in and I registered with them in the city today. Uh, 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 uh. Papa? Uh, did I hear you correctly? You said you registered with Christian Women, sorry, Christian Men Association here in the city. Ha. Uh, Papa, do you, do you live here in the city? I'm just wondering why you're registering with Christian Men Association in the city. Dave, do you see? This is why I say, never allow her to be on top when you people are doing the do. Because she now thinks so she's so important. When you and I are talking, she jumps into our discussion. Papa, please, do not try to change the subject matter. Uh -uh. 
the most important conversation we should have here is you registering with Christian uh, women, uh, sorry, men association in the city. Because I know you do not live here in the city. At the same time, I know that this association is everywhere in the world, including the village where you live. So don't you think it's smarter for you to go back to the village and get registered there? Ha! Papa, but please don't make them play you for one I know. Go back to them and request for your money. So that when you go back, you register in the village. Ha! If now, wow. I am not going anywhere. I have come to stay. And you better start getting used to Papa, that. Papa, no, you're, you're, you're not staying. No, you stop this. Don't place. worry. As for you, I have the key to your Papa, madness. Papa, you will leave. Oh, you right. will go back. I have the key to your madness. <laughs> you stop this madness. Oh this my God. Hey, I have told you that whenever I'm having a conversation with my father, you stay out of it. I did not sign up for polygamy because this is polygamy. Just excuse Two us. wives. Just excuse us. We cannot exist in this house together. <laughs> I have the key to your madness. Don't worry. <laughs> Papa, sorry about let us toast and drink. Sorry to, to this one. <laughs> ah! This is good at camera. I have another gist for you. <laughs> Listen. Why are you always weak? Dave, why are you always weak? Like, when you're supposed to speak up and talk, you do not. When your father is doing something wrong, I expect you to stand up to him and let him know that he's wrong. No, you don't do that. You leave it for me. Then when I add my voice to it, ah, she's a nagging wife. She's the bad one. Why? That man went through hell to make this man your life. That man deprived himself of a whole lot to make this man you got married to. That is why. Oh, please, just tell me something I've not heard before. Tell me something I've not heard before. What is extraordinary about? No, 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 what is it? It's all about how this man went through hell. This man went through hell. Like, seriously, is that the only line you have? Can't you say something new? Because I'm tired, I'm sick and tired of those lines. It doesn't even make sense anymore. Your father was a father to you because he owes it to you. It is his primary responsibility to take care of you as a father should. So cry out loud. How long do I need to push this to you? What is this all that, that, that is extraordinary? Is that the reason you cannot speak up? You can't man up? Aren't you a man now? He knows you to become a man. You are now a man. That man is your father. He's not your God. For crying out loud. For everything that man has done for me, he is my God. That man has been taking care of me ever since I was three months, ever since my mother died. How many men would do that for their kids? Tell me. Even my siblings, even my cousins, everybody said no. They were not going to take care of me because they felt I was going to die. But he did it for me. Mm. Babe, if you say you love me, mm. you should also love my father as well. Well done, sir. Continue to worship him. I am not going to worship your father with you. Excuse me. You don't have to involve your mom in your family matters. It will worsen the case. Okay, so in this case, what am I going to do? Because I am not an orphan. So at this point in my life, the only choice I have is to go back to my parents. No. Go back to my mom. No, you do have a choice. You're my friend and if I don't tell you the truth, then, I'm, then I will not be a good friend. The truth? Yes. Okay, so... I've really observed your father-in-law and I don't think he's a bad person. I think you just wave everything that has happened and be kind to him. You're still angry that he did not support your marriage. My father-in-law is a kind person. Wait, 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 wait. How much of my father-in-law do you know? A man who outrightly rejected me upon the first introduction. A man who has never seen me in his life before, but the first day he saw me, for no reason, he said no. He hated me from that day and he did not hide it from me in any way. A man who, at the mention of my mother's name, said it's going to be over his dead body that his son marries me. Is that the same man you're saying is a nice person? Why didn't you ask what, what the problem is? Of course, I asked him now. I did. I asked him. I said, do you know me before? What have I done to you, sir? He said, no. Go back to your mother and ask your mother. So and I've not really had the time to sit down with my mother and, and have this conversation. Why will you not have time to discuss an issue this serious? Truth is, I, I didn't know that it's going to become this serious. Okay, but for now, you have to be kind to him. You have to just forget everything that has happened and be nice. Even if you have, even if you have to fake it. I'm thirsty. Get me mineral. So, mineral. 
When do you start drinking sweet things? <laughs> I don't want your mother in law's drama. <laughs> <laughs> this girl, you are mad. Please, come on and let me give you a bottle of wine. Which one is Minera? <clears throat> Papa, mm -hmm. I got you this. What is that? A gift. A gift? But it's not my birthday now. I know it's not your birthday. Okay? <clears throat> but I thought of the fact that everybody deserves a gift every day. Not just on birthdays. Besides, every day is a birthday. So I went out to get something for my husband. And I saw this. And I know it's going to be very nice on you. Here. Mm. Mm -hmm. Let me see. This thing, this thing that are booking people so and hang on the street corners. That's what you want to buy for me. This cheap material. I cannot even wear this thing even in my old age. Eh? Eh? Look, look at look at where they put zip. Look at where they put zip. But, but Papa, eh? you, you haven't even opened it. I don't need to open it now. It's very cheap material now. Eh? This thing. Is it not this thing? Oh God! What an insult! Look at what you bought for me. Oh no! And how many did you buy? Where's the second one? Huh? You went to buy cheap material for me and you bought only one. Eh? Huh? And you expect me? You didn't even buy two. Me! A rich man. The father of a rich son who married you and put in the house. You went and bought me cheap material. Not just that. You bought only one. You will see. I will not even wear this. Thing. I will not wear it. Papa. Papa, what have I done to you? What have I done wrong? Why are you making life miserable for me? Why? Papa, I am trying so hard to mend our relationship. So is it so impossible for us to live in peace for the progress of our family, Papa? Can't we just live like a father-in-law and a daughter-in-law in one house in peace? Can't we? Papa, why? I went out of my ways against my wish papa to get you a gift to at least put a smile on your face but you have sworn never to smile papa what else do you want from me what are you looking for my blood did you have you, have you met me in a life before this life papa this is my first time of coming to this life oh me i have not met you before i don't know about you because i don't know what i've done to you you know what i am very very sorry Mm? For pognosing. I'm going to hide off myself to get you a gift. Papa, please forgive me. Don't worry. Let me have my... Yeah, well, I will, well, why should I give it to you? I will keep it as a punishment to show you next time that when you go, you buy me good material. And when you go, you, you buy two, not one. I will keep it. I will wear it. Every day I wear it is to punish you. My friend, just get away. You see you? I will frustrate you out of this house. You will say you lie. I will frustrate Papa, you. Papa, you lie. You cannot mm. frustrate me out of my marriage. God has planted my feet in my husband's house. And not even a man born of a woman can take me out of this house. Because this is my space, okay? This is my space. We shall see. We shall see. Hey, hey, hey. Come on. What is it? Papa, I'm going to let, get the door. Let me get the door. Let me get the Papa, door. Papa, wait, what? Excuse me. What is the matter with you? Papa, why are you the one getting the door? Do you live in this house? Uh -huh. Papa, you are a guest in this house. I should get the door because I need to know if it's somebody I need to let in or not. Well, you don't have much choice in this particular one. This visitor, I know, is always welcome in this house. Just watch. My daughter! <laughs> My daughter! Come inside, come inside. Come into your brother's house. <laughs> come into your brother's house. You are welcome. <laughs> come, 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 come. Let me take you to your room. Quick, 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 come along. Let me take you to your room. Let me take you to your room. Welcome to your brother's house. Eh? <laughs> it is good. It is good. Yeah, welcome. <laughs> David. Yes. We were just three months old. When our mother died and our entire relatives 
blatantly refused to raise us because they thought we were going to die. David, this man here, our father, single-handedly raised us. And here you and I are today. I know all this, so why are you reminding me of mm -hmm, You don't know. I'm just refreshing your memory because you don't know. How do you mean? You, Papa, and I, we share a very strong bond that nobody can break. Do you know that? See, um, Davina, I know that you and Papa and I share a strong bond. You both confessed in my life. It's obvious. Uh, you and Papa will always confess in my life. I, I, don't, I don't think so, Dave. I, I don't think so. You see this man here? This man is my life. David, this man is my world. If anybody, anybody at all disrespects this man here, ah, ah, David. I will do anything. I will go to war with that person. And I promise. So if I were you, I am relating this to you. So you can share this piece of information to that your witch of a wife you call Eve. I'm not going to repeat myself. Dave, I will not repeat this again. Devina. Look, every house has a rule, okay? This is my house, as much as it's your brother's house, but the kitchen is a no-go area. The kitchen is exclusively mine. I am in charge of my kitchen. I govern my kitchen. So it means you're not allowed to go into my pots and dish food without my permission. Devin, I'm talking to you. Madam. Ah! Are you mad? Ah! <laughs> I still have three more slaps for you in case you don't behave. You think, you think, you think I'm my father? Eh? In my brother's house. You are crazy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, I told you, David, I warned you. I told you this evil wife of yours just slapped me. <laughs> what is my offense? I went to the kitchen. Small food though, just thinking about this. I did this little food for myself. She came here, she slapped me. She said, I have no reason to go to her kitchen. That I shouldn't eat in this house. I'm not supposed to eat in my brother's house. Why? Why? Devina. <laughs> Devina. What, what, are you, what, are you t what are you talking about? Why would you slap my sister? My, my twin sister. David, are you serious? Your sister just practically slapped me. Oh, please cross. stop that nonsense. Stop this pretense. Why, 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 why would you slap her? Uh -uh. I said your sister just slapped me across my face this minute. And then you come in here to say that I slapped your sister. I only did react to her because I was waiting for you to come back. What have I done to you people? What have I done to you people in this house that you want to kill me? What have I done to you people? Sorry, you know what? I, I am leaving you. I'm not going to leave you. David, leave me alone. Leave me the hell alone. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It, it hasn't gotten to you leaving, but... Of course it has. Oh, really? You cannot stand with me against your family. Yeah, 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 I, Is that it? I, I will stand with you. I am here with you in this house and it's as though I'm alone. All of you are ganging up against me. David, I have a mother who is alive. Alright? I will not let you subject me to this. Because you people are going to kill me one day. And I will not be there to explain my part of the story. I, I, now leave me alone! I'm, so, I'm, so, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Leave me alone. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll fix everything, okay? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> ah. My daughter, my true lioness. I know. <laughs> I know. 
I am my father's daughter. <laughs> this is my brother's house. As well as my... <laughs> Our present scares her. Are you imagining? <laughs> <laughs> Ah, this she's, is exactly how it should be. She doesn't know anything. In my father, in my brother's house, oh. your son's house, oh. she wants to grow wings. <laughs> Look at small evil. I told her, I'll, 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 I'll put her in up. Mama, Mama, I am tired. I'm frustrated. What is it again? Mama, is this is this is this what marriage is about? What kind of marriage have I found myself in? I have a husband who cannot even stand with me, who cannot fight for me. What happened again? First, the sister came in unannounced. No information whatsoever. I frowned at it. But later on, I didn't have a choice because she was already there, so I accepted and welcomed her in. Okay. The next minute, this girl was in my kitchen, straight into my pot of food, without asking or seeking permission. Now I went to her to let her know that things are not done like this around here. You have to at least ask. Mama, I had not finished talking when this girl gave me a dirty slap. What? Okay now. She did what? Mama, she slapped me like, eh? Slapped me. I was so in shock. I was holding my face like this and still trying to, you know, wake up from that dream. When suddenly her brother came in and she switched it up. Held her face and started screaming. Oh, I slapped her. Oh, I beat her up and all that. And they believed her? Like hell he did. Wow. Without even asking me. He took everything she said. Mama, is this, is this how I'm going to continue? Those people are going to kill me. Oh. I can't. I'm tired. Where is he now? He's at work. Go and get me my phone. It's on the dining. Go. Mama, ha. Me, I'm tired though. I keep saying this thing. I'm tired. I'm tired. <laughs> Marriage, they say, is not a bed of roses. And uh, the ability of the couple to uh, wait through situations like this is what makes them strong. Eve was here shortly. She told me what happened between your sister and herself. What Eve did was wrong. She had no right to slap my sister. Yes, you're right. But did you take time to find out the possibility of uh, your sister not telling you the right thing that happened? Yes, I walked in on them, Mama. Did you see Eve slapping your sister? I saw my sister caressing her cheek. Which means you did not see her slapper. And you did not consider the fact that your sister might have told you the wrong thing. Listen, my son, I didn't call you to talk about what if uh, did or did not do. I just called you to tell you that the pride of every woman is to stand to for her husband to stand by her no matter what happens every woman needs a man to stand by her in times like this otherwise you will lose your respect where your wife is see next time when something like that happens all you can do is protect your wife support her publicly but you can go inside and scold her for whatever she has done wrong it's fine, Mama. I've had you. Thank you very much. Baby, I'm sorry. Baby. Don't touch me. I said I'm sorry. Okay. Leave me I'll alone. touch you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry now. I'm sorry. Sorry, I got your car. Hey, baby. Ah! Ah! Yes. 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 Yes.
Foi já bonito. <risos> Tadá! Ai, cada um filho disse. That's impossible. I got her. It's possible. That's very we can't happen. Why? Papa, it has happened. Very wrong. Why, Papa? Very wrong. You're encouraging her to insult me. I mean, after insulting me, you reward her with the gift of a car. You are encouraging her to insult me. And then, you left your twin sister, your own twin sister, to buy a car for her. I, I, I don't even own a bicycle. Papa, Papa, me help me I, I, I will still buy Papa, a car calm for her. Down. Are you ah. My son, this one, you did it very wrong. <laughs> This is very, very wrong. Let me see. Let me see the color. What, what does it do? Thank you. My daughter, take. Mom! That is your car. Ta -da! Papa, I don't understand. What is it? That is her car. That first. That is my car. She first before you. No, I, I'm not going. What? This is unacceptable. Mommy! Oh. Ah. Ah. Look! Ah. Look! Wait! Jesus. Hey! Suya! If anything happens to this guy, I will kill you! Please, come here. If anything happens to my wife, I swear to God, the both of you will regret having me as a brother and as a son. Look at you, David. So you're yelling at me and Papa after everything Dad has done. What did he do for me? Tell me. What did he do for me that other fathers haven't done? Yes, you took care of me. You pay school fees for me. Is that not your job? Eh? So I should owe you my life for that. You are my father. That's your responsibility. I don't owe you my life for that. Dave, did you just say that to me? Yes, I said that to you. No one else here. What about me that defined the session for you, David? Then your father's your responsibility for that. If your father was responsible enough, he would take care of me and you without having any of us sacrifice for the other. Blame him for that. Nonsense. <laughs> Did Dave just call me responsible? Because of uh, all that your brother said, <laughs> don't let it worry you. He's just uh, reacting to the shock of what just happened. I know the son I gave birth to. Dave can never turn his back on me. Papa, how can you say I shouldn't let the things he said bother me? Papa, did you see your son? Did you see how mad Dave was? For the first time in my life, I saw my brother like that. Papa, Dave stood up to you. Mm. It has never happened before. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'll correct that as soon as he gets back. I know how to handle myself. Leave that to me, all right? Papa, I'm no longer comfortable with the whole situation. At this point, I might have to go home or you're just a coward. That's what you are. Okay, you want to just a little worry, right? Eh? And you run away. You're already running. Now you want to run away and leave the house for her. Hmm? Leave her alone so that she will not kill your brother, right? Listen very carefully, my friend. You're not going anywhere. Is that clear? Yeah. You're not going anywhere. My son, I have never really been embarrassed by anyone before the way you embarrassed me the other day. So, after all that you and I have suffered in this life, after all the sacrifices I have made to bring you to where you are today, you call me a failure. Um, 
Papa, I'm sorry. You know, I didn't mean any of those things I said. I was just in shock. You know, I, after seeing my wife in the state she was in, I, 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 I just fled up. Hey, hey! I, I would have said it now. Is it not my son again? I, 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 I knew it was the shock that was making you shout at me and your sister. Hey, hey! <laughs> I would have said so. I'm glad you understand. Mm, no problem. Well, Papa, when are you leaving? What is it? Are you sending me away because of your wife? I'm not sending you away. I just asked you a question. When are you leaving? Anyway, I'm leaving tomorrow. You know, I just got a call from the village. Mm. You know your uncle Obi uh -huh. <laughs> They told me that a young man is coming to seek for the hand of Obi Akwe's daughter in marriage. And as the oldest member of the family, I must be in present. Without me, nobody can give her away in marriage. And so I'm leaving tomorrow morning. So you're leaving tomorrow morning? Is that not what I just said now? I'm sorry, Papa. And I will send you money for transportation and every other thing. I'll send you money for it. All right, all right. Please take care of your sister. Wait, Papa. You're not living with her. What is she still doing here? What is she still doing in her brother's house? Look, let me tell you. If you think I will leave you alone in the hands of that pretentious girl you call your wife, far, far, far. Um, Papa, first of all, my wife is not pretentious. Secondly, her name is Eve, not that girl. Papa, I'll send you the money. I'll send you. You will do what I want, whether you like it or not. You will do what I want. If you talk again, man, you will do it. Uh -huh. ah, Where is my bag? I already kept it in the car. All right. Did you get it a lot? Yes, I did. I'll manage it. Papa, did you say manage? Yes, no. Why are you sounding as if you sent me 10 million naira? Is it not just 100,000 that you sent? No problem. Let's go. Ah, let's go. Hey. Oh, Papa. Huh? Did you call 100,000 there just? Eh, no. He sent you 100k. Is you up to the money I spent on him? Please forget that one. Listen. Remember our schedule of activities. Hmm? She must see and feel hell in this house until she leaves. Papa, leave that to me. That is why I'm here. Leave that to me. I'll handle her. Alright. Right. Uh, I'm coming. Let's go. I miss you. Uh, I know. I know. My <laughs> John. Yes. It shocked you. Hmm? <laughs> mm -hmm. Welcome back. Listen. Henceforth, every morning I wake up, I am going to bless you with a beautiful slap. Yes. It is a promise. As long as you remain in this house, hey, Devina, I will slap you. If God wakes me up tomorrow, I will slap you. Next tomorrow, I will slap you. It is a promise. I'm not just bragging. If I were you, I would go in there, pack my things, and get the hell out of this house. <laughs> because, my dear, power has changed hands. This is no longer the eve of yesterday. Oh, you think you can mess me up? No, you think you can mess me up? Slaps me and I ended up in the hospital. <laughs> My dear, things have changed. Welcome to reality. Stupid girl. See you in the morning hmm? for your next slap. Fool.
What just happened right now? Eve slapped me. And I didn't do anything. Definitely did not do, did not react. Ah! Ah, 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 you are done for. If you are in this house, you slapped me. You slapped me in this house. Me, <laughs> even look at my face. Your wife slapped me. Ah, <sighs> Davina, you are an adult. I think it's about time you start behaving like one. David, so this is it. Your wife slaps me, and you insult me. My wife did not slap you. My wife can never slap you. David, you're calling me a liar. Your twin sister, why would you think I would lie to you? Don't look at my face. There's nothing there. The wife I know did not slap you. And if at all there's a slap, I'm sure she would be on the receiving end. Because the you I know will not hesitate to slap her. So did you slap my wife? David. David, you're calling me a liar. I'm telling you that I was just, I was just sitting here minding my business and eating my perfect. The next thing she came and moi. On my face! I and you think I'm lying. Why would I lie You're to you, David? Lying. Okay, if you think I'm lying, well, let's go and confront her. Let's Nobody go. is confronting my wife here. No, stop it. And you listen. She is still trying to recover from the concussion that you and Papa put her through. No one should stop me and my wife. I have been looking for the opportunity to slap that girl since that day that she slapped me. Only for her to come and push me and drag key with me and knock me out. <laughs> my sister, all the time I've spent in that hospital, the only thing on my mind was getting back home to slap that girl. In fact, that first slap she gave me started hurting me all over again. That's a little too harsh now. Hey. The one she's been doing to me is not harsh. This small one that I did to Hannah is harsh. <laughs> My sister, I beg, just say something else. But she's still your husband's sister. Also, because she's my husband's sister, I deserve to be slapped by her every day, right? <laughs> I beg ye. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, madam. And where do you think you're going? Eh? <laughs> madam, come here. Eve. Mm-hmm. I want to believe you're not talking to me. No, 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 I am, I am talking to your ghosts. Listen, mm. Eve or whatever you call yourself, mm -hmm. the next time you talk to me, you better bring your- What do you think you're talking to? Are you mad? You won't carry me shine. You did wine, you did craze. Look at this girl, oh. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Like, like seriously. <laughs> because there's a stranger in our midst, you want to do what? You want to act like you are what? Don't try it again in your life. Don't try it. Don't try it though. Oh yeah. Go inside and get a drink to refill my, my, my friend's glass. Now. <laughs> I'm talking to you, madam. Go and get a drink to refill my friend's No. Go with hers. Just hers. Idiots. I bet rush. Mm. What was that for? What was what for? Eh? That one. She hasn't seen anything, oh. But really, she hasn't seen anything yet. By the time I'm done with that girl, the only thing that will save her hmm, is just her leaving my house. Eve, that's Otherwise, me. every day, na slap. Every day, one slap. That one at today register just marked like this. That's been extreme, Eve. Oh. <sighs> uh huh. And where are you, where are you off to? Madam, where are you going? I'm going to see a friend. Just get a crystal. 
Now me, you they talk to you back me the spread, the white shoulder. Like really. Madam, turn around and answer me. Where do you think you're going? Where do they go? Where you they go? Huh? I said I'm going to see a friend. Madam, you're going to go in there hmm? and prepare food for your brother to eat when he comes back from work. When next you think of going out of this house, run it with me, okay? This is not a five-star hotel where you can come in and go out just the way you like. All right, check with me to be sure I don't have plans for you. Now run along. Silly girl. Are you on pause? Move! Uh-uh. No sense, just carry back the waka, waka anyhow. My friend, drink. Mm -hmm. No drink, oh. I don't even trust that girl. Drink fire, this girl. Mm -hmm. God forbid, don't worry, I'll go and get another glass of drink. I just did that. She can't poison you. Evil gay. Hmm. Where are you going? Uh, um, the food is almost ready. I was hoping we're going to eat together as a family. I'll pass. I have something to do inside. Uh, Davina, I think he's right. Let's all eat together. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, um, I'm actually loving the fact that you two are getting along together. I mean, why not? Um, I thought about the whole thing and I said to myself, Eve, there is no reward in violence. You understand it is very important that we live together as one big happy family. So <clears throat> that's Wow. That's it. Wow. <laughs> you know, I just wish Papa was here to see you both bonding. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Come here. Mm, my, well, my, my baby. Yes, my baby. <laughs> um <clears throat> I'll just go into the kitchen now to check and be sure that the food is oh, okay. is ready so I can serve. <clears throat> oh, Davina, darling, I was hoping you you would come with me to the kitchen so we can get the table set. What do you think? <laughs> I'm sure you can handle that. No, come on, Davina. She's trying. Davina, <laughs> come, baby. Oh, my sweetheart. <laughs> you know, let's just set the table. I know, right? Uh -uh. <sighs> Madame Davina. I'll call you right back, okay? Aren't you supposed to be in the kitchen cleaning up the dishes after meal? What are you doing here? <sighs> Sorry, I had to take this call. It's important. Oh, really? In other words, this call is more important than you cleaning up the mess after meal. <laughs> this girl, like you're forgetting yourself. Oh, you're beginning to forget yourself. See, the only reason I am not going to slap you right now is because you already took one today. Don't try me again. No, go to the kitchen and clean up. I do not even raise my voice, all right? Are you listening to what I'm saying? So that you don't call a double dose in a day. That doesn't make sense. The phone is more important than that. You better clean up well and fast. Hey, Davina. 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 Can you, can you believe it? Your sister is there washing the dishes for me. And what is wrong with that? No, 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 everything is wrong. She doesn't need to do that. 
I mean, why would she be the person to wash the dishes we just ate with? It is my responsibility. I should do that for her, for crying out loud, that is my husband's sister. You know, I'm loving the person I'm seeing now. You, you know, in Africa, you're not just married to the man, you're married to the man's family. So you, you, you give equal respect. So she shouldn't do that next time, I just told her, she shouldn't. No, for real, I mean, why? Somebody walks in and sees my sister-in-law washing the dishes, it doesn't even make any sense. It's that, as if I'm, I'm enslaving her. Let me do that. You know, you're making me fall in love all over again. Right? I swear to God. Um, isn't that what beautiful families are meant for? Yeah, that's what they're meant for. So, you said you're in love with me. Mm. So, come inside and show me how much you've fallen for me. I can't even start it right now. Come here. <laughs> hmm. Papa, I mean everything, no. Why actually, Jura Mabum? This witch has been slapping me every day since you left. Now, the food team can't even see my cheek. <laughs> that is what baffles me the most. That you know me now. Ima Mwagi, Ima Agunwa Emo. This thing is not ordinary. That witch is using charm on me. Because I don't understand how she will slap me and I cannot do anything. It's not ordinary. <laughs> that one, you know your son. I've told him countless times, but boy, you know he will feel like I'm trying to stir problem in his marriage. Then why why am I bugum? This man has been slapping me. Then you please come back, oh. Come back before I hear boom here. This man will kill me in this house, so please come back fast. You like it, right? My father. Mm. Papa, where, where is that? Thank you. Papa? Where is that witch that calls herself Eve? <laughs> Next time you lay your filthy hands on my daughter again, I'll break all the bones in your body. My daughter. Oh, Papa, was that necessary? Papa! That is for standing by and watching her manhandle your twin sister. You're not ashamed of yourself. While people are busy worshipping their in-laws, this one is busy slapping her, her, her own in-law about. You brought this bag of trouble into my house. Go to that taxi and get my bag and take it inside. Come back here! Don't worry. I'll go and bring the bag. I like the bass boss. Bass boss. Hey! Papa! Welcome! My father! The lion! The champion! I will deal ruthless. Let me go and bring your bag. Go and bring it. Hey! Nonsense. Welcome, my father! You don't know anything yet. I fortified myself in the village. Nonsense and ingredients inside the nonsense. This is it, right? This is what you want, isn't it? This is what you have reduced me to in my own house. A wife who gets beaten up and slapped by her in-laws. Father-in-law and sister-in-law at the same time. And I have a husband who cannot stand and defend me. Sorry. Of course, of course you are sorry, isn't it? Isn't that, that, That's all you have to tell me. Sorry. That's the composition I get for being slapped. You cannot stand up for me. You cannot defend me. You know what? Growing up, I was told that how a man treats his wife determines how he wants to be respected. So now tell me, is this the kind of respect you want from me as your wife? Answer me. Is this? Do I, do I, do I even deserve this? What have I done? What have I done to you and your family? You have done nothing. So what is all this? Is this? Hey, I'm sorry. Leave me alone! Leave me alone! 
you're not a man you're a boy because that's how you're acting you're acting like a boy a little boy you cannot stand and face your family you can't defend your wife so how are you going to defend our children when they come no tell me what kind of a father are you going to be to them a father who sits by and watches everything goes wrong with his family So you mean Dave hasn't said anything? It's not like I'm expecting him to say a word. Somebody who literally does not have a mind of his own. Just acting like a little boy. Acting like an idiot. I know, but that's very bad. Susan, bad is an understatement. Um. See, I feel so suffocated in this house. Everything suffocates me. Those people are out to kill me. Because, I mean, I don't, I don't know whoever suffers like this in a husband's house. With her husband present, for that matter, my husband is here. It's not like this is happening in his absence, though. He's right there, just acting like an idiot. I can understand. Hey. Madam, what are you doing here? Hmm? Always busy doing nothing. Um, I need you to go and get me a glass of drink from the fridge. I don't mind. Devina, the drinks are in the fridge. And you know where the fridge is. So, I'm supposed to go get it myself. <laughs> What's that your name again? Eve. You seem to forget that Papa is around. So, would you want to go get the drink? Or do you want me to involve Papa? The choice is yours, my love. Will you get her from that place and go and get me what I want, Jerry? Madam, stand up there! Ah. There isn't time to stand up. <sighs> Be right back. Move it. How do you want it? Cold or hot? Cold. 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 Shh. 